Hey folks, I'm still at the Twitch booth and I'm here with my friend, Cobalt Streak. How are you today? How are you enjoying PAX? I'm doing wonderful. PAX is always a pleasure, great time, lots of energy, um, lots of awesome games. So, excited to be here. Awesome. Now, is this your first PAX, second PAX? How many PAXs have you been to? So, I've been to every North America PAX for the past three years. Okay. I, all around the world, it's, it's business for me and it's also pleasure, so it's like, a little bit of a getaway, also a lot of fun. So, best of both worlds. Awesome. Now, which uh, out of the North American packs is which is your favorite? Um, I would say probably Prime. Um, this one actually this year has been much better just because of the weather. It's not freezing and there's not five feet of snow, so Boston's growing on me a little bit. So I would say um, probably Prime a little bit, but Boston's definitely up there now. So, awesome. So for folks who don't know. What do you stream? What are some of the games that you like to play? Um, so mostly I play a lot of different indie games. I do some AAA stuff, but um, I'm mostly known for Binding of Isaac. I do Into the Gungeon, Darkest Dungeon, Punch Club, FTL, uh, stuff like that. I've been doing some Dark Souls as well. Um, I really love the Dark Souls series. I've beaten like everyone on stream before. A little GTA 5, you know, just whatever I think the community is really into and will enjoy watching me play. So now, do you choose the games that you play because of what you want to play, or do you uh, think of like, oh, okay, the community would prefer to watch me play this? Uh, it's really a compromise because it is a business. So I want to I want to meet people halfway. I want to make sure that it's something the majority of my community likes and something that I also will want to play as well. So sometimes, if my I feel like my community's not feeling it, I jump off of it. Otherwise, you know, um, I'll played it all the way through. Um, so it's a bit of a compromise, you know, because it, it is a business and my job is to entertain. Right. So I want to be as entertaining as possible and make the majority of my community happy. So it's a bit of both. Okay. Now, how long have you been streaming? I've been streaming for about, it's going to be four years this August. Okay. So been around for a while, a little bit. Wow. So so since you've been here for a while, what was what's the evolution been like for the streaming and Twitch in general? Oh man, it, it has just exploded. Honestly, there's so many more people streaming, there's so many more people watching, um, there's so many more games that are coming to Twitch to get their name out there, and uh, especially like the indie world, which is where I, I really like shine a lot. Um, it's, it's just, it has grown so explosively, it's been amazing. I, it's like, I feel like it's like a wave, you know, and it's like this new wave, and you just want to be a part of the, like the, that motion, you know, like, um, I, I don't know. It's it's great. It's it's grown tremendously. Fantastic. Now, for folks that want to watch you, how can they find you? Well, what uh, what's your channel? What's your social media? I'm a Cobalt Streak on Twitch. I also have a YouTube channel as well, Twitter. Um, I stream every single day for six hours, five to eleven p.m. Central. I'm probably one of the most dedicated, passionate people you'll ever find. It's like I will be doing this until I'm 80 years old if I can do it. Like my whole life. It's it's what I love to do. So. Fantastic. Thank you so much for your time, man. Enjoy the rest of your packs. You as well. Thank you.